hi and uh, welcome to another video today we are doing a diy in the kitchen um i want to make this corner of my kitchen to look nice and warm so i'm going to be installing a snake light uh, this is a snake light i have about um a meter, a meter and a half of the snake light and um, I have an LED connector this is what connects the snake light to the power source the connection happens right here so you just insert the snake light into the connector and um, I will be using a double-sided tape um, I'm hoping that it will hold and not fall off because um, some people use silicone but I think the tape is working well so far because I've, I've installed on this connector and as you can see it's really strong um, so I'll, I'll show you how I'll be doing it um, that's the light and then we can see the final result of this I'm looking forward to the to the new look of this um, kitchen corner um, I'm not extending it further I just want it at this corner I think that should be enough cozy lighting because we still have the overhead lighting in the kitchen so I'm trying to take this snake light underneath the cabinet um, An accident happened. Camera down. I repeat, camera down. But anywho, uh, challenges of DIY. So let's continue. So I, I, I'm taking a big piece of um, of the tape. I realize if you take a small piece. It's not uh, very, it's not holding very tight. So let's take a, a big piece and try to, to attach it. So this side has a paper and this side has some glue. So just take like that and attach the side with the glue and the snake light and then peel off the paper it's a bit tricky but it comes out eventually We peel out. There you go. We peel out this paper and leave the glued part exposed. And you place it where you want the tape to hold. And that's it. Then we'll do the same for the remaining part.
so in case you're wondering um i'm actually taping uh, right here here below the cabinet i was using some silicone be before you can see a bit of silicone but uh, it was not strong enough so the light fell off so i'm trying to see this other method if it's gonna work So I'm done fixing um, the tip. Let's see how it looks like. It's right under here. See, it's just running under the cabinet. And now it's the moment of truth. Let's see. Let's see if it works, guys. Feels quite uh, stable. I think the tip is holding really nice. This is the tip I'm using. It's a double-sided tip. Okay, let me test and see. One, two, three. Yay! Look at that. Look at that. That's really awesome. Um, let me switch off the the overhead lights or effects. I just want to see how it looks like without uh, without this this lighting wow wow this looks really nice look at that when you don't really need a lot of um, light in the kitchen probably you're just picking something or you're just making a quick cup of tea and you don't need a lot of lighting i think this is really nice look at this side without the lighting hmm. doesn't look really nice but uh, i guess one side i think that's that is enough that that is really nice and it will do it so i have been doing some renovations not really renovations some changes in the kitchen um, and probably i will share it in another video as usual thank you for watching thank you for clicking and i will see you on the next one bye